table manipulation. In this video, we are going to see about table manipulation. Draw table. To draw a table, use draw table option on the insert tab under table section. Click where you want to create the table. The pointer changes to a pencil. Then follow the steps to draw a desired table. First, draw a rectangle box to define an outer table boundary. Then draw the column line and row line inside the rectangle. To erase a line or block of lines, click Eraser in the Draw Border Group under Table Tool on the Design tab. Then, click that line you want to erase. Insert Table To insert a table, place the cursor where you want to insert the table. On the Insert tab, in the table group, click table and then click insert table. You will navigate to an insert table dialog box. In that dialog box, enter the number of columns and rows. Click OK to insert a table. Inserting table using grid and mouse. To follow this method to insert a table, choose Insert to Table. Then move your mouse over the grid until you have a table with the number of rows and columns you want. Change Cell Width and Height To change the cell width and height, First, select the cells in the table that you want to change. Then, click the Layout tab which is under the Table tool. Use the Cell Margin option to change cell width and height. Table Options dialog box will appear. Change top, bottom, left and right values, then click OK to apply changes. Alignment of text in cell. By default, any text within a cell is aligned as top left corner of the cell. There are 9 possible alignment choices are present in the alignment group of the layout tab of table tools. Top left Top center Top right, center left, center, center right, bottom left, bottom middle. Bottom right. Reorienting text in the table. Normally, text is oriented from left to right by default. Each time text direction button is clicked, Direction of text gets changed from bottom to top.
insert rows and columns. To insert a row above the insertion point, click Insert Above button. To insert a row below the insertion point, click Insert Below button. To insert a column to the left of the insertion point, click Insert Left button. To insert a column to the right of the insertion point, then click Insert Right button. Rows and you can also insert rows and columns by clicking the small arrow in the corner of the row and column section. You will navigate to the insert cells dialog box. One of the op you can select any one of the option to insert rows and columns. Delete rows and columns. To delete rows and columns, first place the cursor on the part of the table you want to delete. Out, select Layout, Delete button under Rows and Columns section. Then use Delete button's drop-down menu to choose the table element you want to remove. 